Hello my lovelies and welcome to Vidmas Day 2. Today I will be talking through my favourite recipe of this particular season. I absolutely love it, it may not be to everybody's tastes but I absolutely love it and if you're like me and you absolutely adore chai tea then this will be the recipe for you. Now the first thing I do is I preheat my oven to 350 degrees. Um, I can't quite remember what that is in gas marks, so you're just going to have to figure that one out for yourself. Um, but yeah, so I'm just going to go through the ingredients really quickly. And the first thing you need are two three quarter cups of plain flour. You can get actual measuring cups that are done in this measurement um, from certain places. So if that's what you need, then that will really help you. The next thing that I need or you need is one teaspoon of baking soda and half a teaspoon of baking powder. Now they are different so just remember that don't think that you can like you know take off one and not use the other or whatever. The next ingredient you will need is one three quarter cup of white sugar. Um, Yep, and I don't actually make the herb mix myself. What I do is I use five or six chai tea tea bags. You can pick these up for reasonably cheap. I think mine are sort of £1.20 for like 100 tea bags in Asda. So pick them up. They're really, really helpful. You can use them for this. You can drink it, obviously. And you just rip open the tea bag and use the stuff that's inside. And the last three ingredients that you will need is one cup of unsalted butter that has been softened at room temperature. You will need one egg and you will need half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. So you, yes. And now for the directions, you preheat your oven to 350 degrees and you line a baking sheet with parchment paper and just leave it next to you ready. In a large bowl, sift together the flour the baking soda, the baking powder and salt. So you mix that together and set that aside as well. And then in a medium bowl, combine sugar, the chai mix um, and remove a quarter of the cup of the mixture in there and set aside to reserve for rolling out the cookies. Now in a bowl, um, I mix the butter and the sugar and spice mixture until it's about light and till it's nice and light and fluffy. I do this with a wooden spoon. If you have a mixer, then definitely use it because that will make life a whole lot easier. However, I do it with a wooden spoon because I don't have a mixture. And then you beat in the egg and the vanilla extract. I do this in sections just because it makes life a bit easier and you just mix it until it's all combined together. And then you slowly and surely, I do this normally two tablespoons at a time, mix in all of the dry ingredients to the wet ingredients, and you mix it until it's combined nicely. And then what I do, and this is where I slightly differ from the recipe that I have, is I will roll this up into a tube, um, cover it in um, cling film, put it in the fridge for about an hour, and then I take it out and I slice it and obviously mould it into the shapes or the sizes that I want. And then I bake them for about 8 to 10 minutes. Um, they don't need that much more than that because they are only quite thin biscuits. They don't need a lot more than that. And then leave them, obviously take them out after that time to cool. And they are great. Um, these can be stored um, in an airtight container at room temperature for about 3 days. So they make a really, really good little gift maybe, or like I, you know, make them in a nice little pretty decorative box or whatever. Um, or they just make really, really lovely little snacks for winter evenings with a nice cup of chai or with a cup of hot chocolate or something. And it's definitely something that I make quite regularly um, during this time of year. So, and everybody I know really, really likes them, even if they don't like chai tea. So yeah that is my chai tea cookie recipe basically um i really if you do try it out please let me know send me pictures or um whatever or go on to instagram if you want to take pictures and just tag my handle in it so i can see what you guys have been up to and um yeah i will see you tomorrow for day three i love you all very much Bye bye